Hi, I'm making this video because over the years we have wanted to use this beautiful woven ribbon technique and we've seen it on our projects in the shop on the samples we've made and we have sort of forgotten and remembered again and then forgotten how to do this technique so now it's going to be on the internet forever until the world ends and you guys can do it too. So here is how to weave this ribbon into a beautiful chain. I'm sure there's a name for it but I don't know it so enjoy. Okay, so I've got my pile of ribbon here, and this project doesn't start on the end of the ribbon. It starts in the middle, and getting started is the most important part, I promise you. I've done a few takes of this. So, what I'm going to do first is just make a loop with my ribbon, okay? Hold it between my thumb and forefinger, and then I'm going to make another loop, but I'm going to go in front of this ribbon here, and I'm going to... There we go. Bring my ribbon around and hold it like this. Then I'm going to make a loop. Bring my forefinger underneath the ribbon, make a loop, put it through this loop here. Hold tight and tighten this loop so that the tension is nice. Don't tighten it too tight. Make it the width of the ribbon. Fold again, put your loop through your other loop, and I like to hold right here, right under where my channel is, where I'm going to pull, and just begin again. I'm putting my forefinger under there, making a loop, putting it through my other loop. a little easier when there's not a camera in your lap. And really, I mean, once you get started, it's super easy. And that's the thing, you find one that's already made in your sewing studio and you understand how it's woven together, but you don't understand how it started. Then you spend a lot of time figuring it out, and then you decide to make a video, and then you figure it out, and then you forget how to do it mid-video, and you have to take like 15 billion takes. True story. It's just getting longer and longer. Make sure to use ribbon that is pretty on both sides um, because you're seeing both sides of the ribbon. See, I'm flipping it over and you're seeing that side. Or you can use two pieces of ribbon and layer them. And voila, you have a beautiful ribbon chain. You can see we've added it to pillows. I think it would be a really cute headband or something to add on to a purse, maybe at the top of a pocket. I'm sure you'll see it in our other projects that we do online and I'll be able to link to this video to show you how to do them. Ooh.